Hi there! I hope you're having an amazing day so far. My name is Melody. Welcome to my YouTube channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you some of my favorite stuff off of Amazon that is related to like art, stationery, crafts, DIYs, stuff that you would keep in your art room. Let's just say that. <laughs> oh my goodness, I have so much stuff laid out in front of me. Like I have just a big, big basket and like stuff laid, <clears throat> excuse me, all over the floor. So let's get started. So I think I'm going to start off with the category arts and crafts and DIY related stuff. Um, I've never done one of these videos, so I guess let's just start grabbing products and telling you why I love them. The first product I'm going to start off with is just sitting on my lap right now. It's in a pencil case, so it's kind of hard to show you. But what these are, are um, acrylic paint pens slash markers, I guess. Um, honestly, I love these. The, as you can probably see, a lot of these are unopened. But I have used this brand in the past, and I really do like them a lot. I haven't used them a ton on like different surfaces, mainly just like plastic. Um, plastic, yeah, I guess that's about it as of yet. <laughs> but these can be used on so many different things, like just any surface you can really think of, honestly. Um, I'm not sure how well they hold up on fabric, but I'm sure they would work for that too if you really wanted to use them for that. But yeah, I just, the main thing I love about them is just that they're so easy to use, they're mess-free, there's so many different colors, and yeah, just nothing but great things to say about that. And if you love doing art and painting, especially in like places where you don't really want to bring a break, big wooden paint palette and all your different separate paints. You, all you need is just this little case of paint pens and they're awesome. They were great and highly recommend. Okay, so next up I have, it's kind of like a two in one because it's actually in here right now. But the first item I wanted to talk about is this itself. It's this super compact, awesome, protective sleeve for like pretty much any kind of pens or pencils that you want to put in here. Markers too, anything really. But what I use them for is my um, colored pencils. But this is what it looks like organized. I have all my colored pencils organized by color. So just it's a beautiful blended rainbow. I love it. And it's just so easy to travel with. They don't fall out. It ha It's so nice to just like lay it out on your table or countertop and just look at them all and grab whatever one you need opposed to like a pencil case, which I showed you for the acrylic pens where you just gotta dig around. This, I just, I love it. It's such a, it's a, such a better idea. And I've been using it for a long time and it was quite affordable when I bought it. I'm definitely gonna link it down below. It works great. It's compact, it's heavy duty, it hasn't ripped or teared or anything like that. So if you're looking for a good organizer for like, like I said, any kind of pens, pencils, or colored pencils if you wanted to, I really do recommend this a lot. And to put away, it is so easy, like you just take it, fold it, this is so hard to show, and then you just wrap it on up. And wrap a little strap around, clip it on, and it's, it's great. I love it. It's, yeah. Okay, you get the point. Next item, it was actually chilling in my case right here. I took it out to show you what it is. And if you're someone who does like pencil drawings, charcoal drawings, pe colored pencil drawings, anything that's erasable and you need like really fine detailing, this is amazing. I love this thing. It is an electric eraser. It comes with tons of different little tips for you to use. I don't know if you can really see that right there, but yeah, it's probably not really going to focus, but they come with like tiny, 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 all the way to big ones. And they last a really long time. Like the way you take it out is you just pop this little bad guy, bad boy out, pull it out. And the erasers are big. So if you're not using it like constantly every single day, these eraser, eraser tips will last you a really long time. This is really great if you need to do like highlighting or if you make a tiny minor mistake or simply you just want to soften something up, you just like, it's very quiet. You can't really even hear it, but you just press this little button, go in and it works so good and I love it. It's so much easier than just like trying to get a tiny little eraser and just like scribble a little mark out. No, this is a must have if you do like any kind of fine detailing with 
pencil, pencil crayon, all that. And the fact that it comes with so many refills and it, the machine itself, plus it's affordable, uh, it's just a win-win. Also, I forgot to mention, it takes batteries. I think they're AAA. Ah, AAA, I was right. So it takes two or three AAAs in there. The next product, I don't know if it really falls into this category, but I use it for this purpose. Uh, so what this is, is a clamp on. This clamp is so strong, like you have to really like use your muscles to squeeze it because it's very strong, very sturdy. And I didn't even mention what this was yet. This is a light. Um, yeah, there you go. <laughs> so what I use this for is I just clamp it on the top of my desk. I have like one of those desks that goes like up with a shelf over top of the desk if that makes sense so I clamp it on the top of the shelf and then just like have it leaning over top of my surface where I'm doing my crafts or my whatever I'm doing on my desk um, and the reason I just love this so much is because it's very bright it's small compact easy to use affordable flexible so if you need to get like really close you can like bring it right down and it's just awesome I love it it's super easy to use and like I said affordable which is a win-win again okay so that was more so of my like uh art like drawing on paper kind of section of this category uh, now I'm going to move on to the more so crafty DIY products that I would use sorry products that I would recommend okay so this is going to be kind of hard to show because it's unraveling like crazy rope honestly if you need to buy a large quantity of rope I would definitely recommend buying it online. Amazon in particular has lots of variety, lots of good options with great quality stuff. And most of the time it's pretty darn affordable compared to like buying it at Michael's or something, way more affordable. Plus the stuff is great quality. I know this stuff you can see is shedding a lot, but this is just that type of rope that it is. I've purchased numerous other ropes on Amazon before and I've loved them. They have held up so well, they're just, they're good quality for what the price is for sure. And you do get a lot of it. This one, I've already used quite a bit of it and it's beginning to unravel. So I kind of can't really show it to you very nicely, but rope, this is great. Next up is kind of similar to the previous one, but that is macrame cording. These two are brand new. I haven't opened these exact ones quite yet, but I have purchased ones from the same sellers in different colors as well as I think this is like my third or fourth one of these exact rolls. I really love this stuff. It works really great. Uh, I'll include both links for both different sellers. I'm pretty certain that they're both from different people. So there's nothing really too crazy special or exciting about the ropes that I'm mentioning. I just more so wanted to include it because they are really great prices for the quantity. Like this one is, oh my gosh, it doesn't say on here, but I'm, I'm pretty sure it's like a thousand and some yards. So that's a lot. The, and I think I only paid like 15 or 16.99 for this, which is a really good deal. Cause if you go to like a local craft store or even just like a hardware store or anything and try to find rope or cording like this, it's expensive and it usually comes in really small quantities. So variety, large quantities, good prices, what more can you ask for, really? Next up is another one that's in its wrapper. So I apologize if I'm making a lot of noise. I'm probably gonna watch this back and realize I'm making a lot of crumpling noises. So I'm really sorry about that, if that is an issue. Anyway, so this item is just a large kit of, I believe it came with like 30, 30 of these. I love, I love that they have such large quantities, especially if you're someone who does lots of crafts or if you're planning to sell crafts. Online is so much better than buying it in store because you can get it in such good bulk and usually it's great quality and almost always it's affordable. So basically what these are, are these little wooden round discs that you can do pretty much whatever you really want on these. You can paint on them. You can do wood burnings, which is what I do. Um, you could do uh, cricket decals, uh, pff, draw. Like you can really do so many things with this. I just love how 
like natural they are like they're all different shapes they're not all the same shape and size so they look just very natural and aesthetic in my opinion they're good quality they're nice and thin so they're not too heavy if you wanted to hang it say like on your car mirror or something they're just really great and they burn very nicely they don't like spider or anything when you burn them with a wood burner. I've purchased these from Michael's craft store in the past and I paid way more. So the fact that these come in a large bulk package and they're a good price and they're good quality, I would definitely be repurchasing them off Amazon rather than Michael's. Okay, uh, next up I have another bulk item for the craft category, um, but these are so handy if you make coasters. I love making like wooden coasters with burnings or paintings or anything like that. I haven't really used them for anything except wood as of now, but I'm sure they would work on other things. So basically what these are is just a very thin adhesive sheet of cork. Um, these I love because they're not too crazy thick. They already have a stick on them and they're obviously easy to cut. So if you have a round coaster, you just gotta like stencil it on here, cut around, boom. It's perfectly shaped to how you like it. They're nice and flexible. So if you need to like bend it around, like a, I don't, I don't know, they're great, okay? They're simple, they're cheap, they're very easy to use. And yeah, it's nice if you don't want your coasters sliding around your table or being loud and bonky. And these are just nice and smooth and, delicate and they glide on your table so nicely. Nice, nicely, nice, nicely. <laughs> okay, so my camera died. So if any of the angles or positioning or anything moved, uh, that is why. So, all right, let's carry on. Okay, so the next item I wanted to talk about is uh, wooden beads. These are not all of them. I couldn't fit all of them in my hands, but I ordered a large variety pack of wooden beads recently. I think they were like under ten dollars honestly and they came in a really large pack with a lot of different size variety which i really thought was a lot of bang for your buck to be honest so i just wanted to mention this one really quick because you can use these for so many different things like for your crocheting projects for if, even if you just wanted to make a string of decorative beads um Honestly, you can use this for anything. Whatever your mind thinks of, like wooden beads are so aesthetic and cute and you can even stain these, like they're natural wood. So you can stain them if you would like to have like more of a deep, like warm vibe. So yeah, I love these. They are great. Okay, one last item for the bulk uh, arty crafty category. Um, uh, keychains are so much more affordable when you buy them in bulk. I noticed that if you buy like even just a single or I think two piece keychain, like, sorry, lobster claw keychains I'm talking about, I'll show you what they look like. Um, but I was trying to find some at Michael's and they're like $4 for two pieces. And this I think was like under $10 for 50 or more, 30 these ones were. And yeah, I think they were like $8, but I also really love the quality of these. Like they are very strong. I don't know if you can see that there. So yeah, basically what these are is just like a small little swivel keychain lobster claw. They're very nice and sturdy. Like they're not flimsy or cheap or anything, which I really like. And you can use these for so many different things. Like there's so many fun DIY keychains and I personally love making DIY keychains. I just think they're so fun and easy and cute and nice for gifts. So I really like that these come in a large pack and they're gold. I love gold. They also came in silver, but yeah. Okay, so the next category I'm gonna do is Cricut supplies. So if you have like a Cricut maker or a Cricut explorer or even like any kind of Cricut maker that you have, you could use these products or whatever one is made specifically for your machine. The main thing I love about all of these is that they're so much more affordable than the actual Cricut brand. Like if you go to Michael's or even just like online, the Cricut brand itself is very expensive. So I really like finding dupes that work very well with your machine as of the other ones would, but for like a fraction of the price. Okay, so I want to start off by showing you one of my favorite things that I got from my Cricut. Um, these are so handy. It's a weeding kit uh, and if you don't know what weeding is it's just like when you print vinyl you have to get all those tiny little pieces out and cut like shape around where you 
cut out so it peels nicely when you peel the remainder off. I'm explaining this terribly, but look up what weeding means and you'll you'll understand. So this is a five piece kit and it comes with such unique things that I couldn't even find at my local Michael's craft store. And if I'm sure if I did, it would be like so much more expensive. It'd be like probably at least 30, maybe $40. I don't know. Okay, so I'm just gonna quickly show you what the kit includes. It comes with these tiny little precise tweezers that like kind of fold, bend over, which is really nice. Just a basic one of these like little rounded hook things. Just a simple straight pokey um, tool. This one is probably one of my favorites. It's a hook that like actually comes out to an angle at the very tip. So it's very easy for getting very precise with this. And lastly, it comes with some very, very fine tip tweezers. Okay, so this item kind of follows along with the one I just previously had mentioned. Uh, so this is just a weeding collector thing. So when you're taking out big chunks of vinyl from your picture, your masterpiece, you just take your tool. I lost my tools, I already put them away. But, you know, you take your poker tool and just wipe it in this little slits here and it just takes the vinyl right off of it. It's very handy, especially when you're wanting to work faster and like also suctions, oopsie, I think vinyl just popped out of here, but it also like suctions to your counter, I think too. So if you want it to be really secure, it suctions down. I've never really used that. So I don't know how well that feature works, but I mainly just use it for when I'm using very small little chunks of vinyl. As you see, there's a chunk of vinyl right there on there. Um, but yeah, very handy and nice and easy to use and it's affordable. Okay, this one is gonna be kind of hard to show, but um, I guess I'll just kind of show you a little glance. These are cutting sheets for your Cricut. Um, if you have a Cricut, you must know that you need these in order to use it or to cut anything with it. So um, it comes with three different grips. It has a standard light and I'm pretty sure the fabric one yeah, I was right. It has the standard light and fabric, which the fabric one is very sticky. Um, I haven't really used it too much, but it works. I love it too because they're the exact same measurements as the Cricut ones and they're literally half the price. Like they're not actually made by the Cricut brand, whereas that um, weeding kit I showed you was made from the Cricut brand. These ones are by Real, Real Like. That's what the brand of these are. I don't know if you can really see that. That is really hard to see because this is clear and it's filthy. So I apologize for that. But yeah, I'm sure you get the point. They work. They're exactly the same size as the other ones. They don't have to maneuver them in any way. They work just the same and way better price. This one doesn't really necessarily fall into the Cricut category just. You can really use this for anything. And this is permanent tape runner. These are what they look like. This is actually refills for this. Uh, you can buy these at the Dollar Tree too, even if you want, but I find that when I buy those there, they run out so fast because they're very small. But these ones you can find at Walmart too. They work great. I love using these for sticking paper together. If you're doing like journaling or if you're doing art, like scrapbooking or if you're doing Cricut projects, any like kind of cards, if you're making just anything. It, I use this all the time in place of glue, like where you would use tape or glue on a piece of paper. They're very sticky, easy to apply, and I love them. I go through them a lot and you can use them really for whatever you'd like. Okay, the last item I wanted to mention for my Cricut is this dust bag. And I don't know if you can very, very, I don't know if you can see it very well is what I was trying to say. Um, Anyways, this is what it looks like. It's gray, it's the only color they had when I bought it, but just, I love the fact that you can just find stuff that you need on Amazon for the exact product you need. My Cricut fits great in here. It's not fuzzy on the inside or anything, but it was a very affordable one. I think, I don't know, I think the other ones were like very expensive. So I just found one that was very affordable. I like it too because it has pockets in here which is very handy for your cords or your tools or anything like that. So if you need to take your Cricut on the go somewhere, it's easy to travel with. Or if you just simply want to tuck your Cricut away without getting it dusty, this is also mainly like a dust bag. So yeah, works works the way it's supposed to. It has a very strong zipper. It's like when the Cricut's in here, it holds very well. It's got a strong cushion handle, strong zipper, and yeah, 
it works great. Okay, the lighting is probably not very good for this, but this is the last Cricut um, item that I wanted to show you. I love this organizer. It's for your, all your vinyls. Um, it works really great for being able to see all of the colors you have, as well as just keep them well and compact and organized. And I think this one was like under $15, so very affordable, very useful and handy. And it holds 48 um, vinyls so it's nice if you have a lot <laughs> like me also here I made these labels with my Cricut so keeps them nice and organized so when you take the wrapper off you know what you're working with okay to finish this video off I am going to quickly just run over some stationary items that I really love that I got off Amazon. If you do like journaling or like bullet journaling, which I love bullet journaling, that's why I have so much station stationary. Um, I really love using washi tape and this is my little box of washi tape. I think two out of the three kits I have, or honestly, I think all of these I got from Amazon. Unfortunately, some of them are discontinued though. I was trying to find the links to this exact one because they're so cool and I really wish I could find the link for them. But basically what they these ones are are like different astrology stuff. Like they're like space themed. They're so cool. I love them. I really hope you can see that. But like some of them also have like, um, I can't think of what it's called. This one has like all the different, um, oh, I can't think of what it's called right now, but stuff such as in like Aquarius, Scorpion, Pisces, what, what is that called? Yeah, I just really love that kit. It has like smaller ones too, like it has like these little star ones, and then this like little spaceship one that has like, oh my goodness, that is so cute, I didn't even notice that. There's like a little astronaut walking on the moon coming out of a spaceship. I don't know if you can see that, but that is so cute. I love these. Yeah, but if you could find these, I would recommend because they work great and so they're adorable. Just if you love outer space or like astrology or stuff like that, those are so cute. I love them. The other ones I got off Amazon, I got this like big pack of so many different colors, like every color of the rainbow and more. So yeah, I think it's a great price on there. Way better compared to like, again, Michael's for example. Such much, such much better price. <laughs> okay, that makes sense, I guess. This one's kind of like more so if you're an organized freak or if you just like labeling stuff. Uh, I got this Dim Dimmo, Dim Dimo uh, label maker off Amazon quite a while back. I still use it every once in a while. I use my Cricut for most of my labels, but this is just one of those things that you can like super quickly make a label. Like basically what you do is you just type your, like pick what letter you want to punch it in and then you just punch and then, oh, you can't really see it, but if you do it a couple times, you can see it punches your letters into it. I think it's really cool and very handy if you want to just make a quick label and when you're done you just go to the cut whoopsie you just go to the cut thing cut oh I just realized I wrote out a gang a gang name so I'm not gonna show that but like let's just say it was that anyways there's your label super easy to use also bought refills on there and this is just one of them because I think I already went through them all but it came in a three pack great price and <laughs> easy to use and Awesome, very handy, I like it. Okay, I don't know if I'm the only one, but I love mechanical pencils, especially 0.9 millimeters. I know that's so random and so weird, but I just find that like 0.5 and seven, I just, I don't know, I don't write as neat and my writing just doesn't look as good. So I love the thicker the pencil and 0.9 is just perfect for me and I can't find it anywhere. Literally any office store, any craft store, they never have 0.9 pencils or lead, and I don't know why. But yeah, anyways, I love these. I got them off Amazon, came in a two pack. I can't find my other one right now, but it's so cute. It's like a, just a little yellow pencil that's mechanical. It's comfy to use and I love it. It's 0.9. Also, I got refills off Amazon. So if you're a 0 0.09 millimeter lover, Amazon. Okay, so I ran into another complication when filming and I had like two minutes left to film. So uh, my SD card was full, so I didn't feel like running and getting another one right now. So 
now we're just gonna finish the last couple minutes on my phone so i hope it sounds okay and looks okay i just kind of wanted to wrap this video up quick all right so the last couple items i wanted to mention to you were all stationary um i think when i my camera cut off i was just finishing telling you about my pencil that i love um so yeah that's pretty much all I had to say about it. I think I got the point across. I like the point nine. Can't find it anywhere other than Amazon. Good price, lots in here, 12 pieces or 12 tubes with 15 leads per tube. So do the math, but yeah, I love that. All the rest I have are like markers and pens. These two specifically came in a two pack and I love these so much for if you're doing like bullet journaling or if you do like calligraphy or something like that, or just pen art, anything like that. These are very high quality, very pigmented black felt tip pens. One is a firm tip, one is a soft tip, which makes doing like fancy writing, like such as a calligraphy, like I said, really easy. And these are really good quality. These are by the brand Tombow. And if you get these like at Michael's or anywhere else, they're very expensive. And I believe I got both of these for like $3 or $4 on Amazon. So great find, love these. These ones are kind of random, but I'm just going to quickly mention them. These are metallic Sharpies. I'm pretty sure you could probably find these at a lot of other places too, but I love Amazon and these were affordable on there. And I love these specifically because they're metallic. So when you write on like anything that's like black or a different color or anything, it just like is like paint. It works so good and it's so boom gold and it's so pretty. And yeah, you, you, you like what I'm saying. So it. They work great and very much like these great price next up are these set of five highlighters they're double ended they're by zebra zebra is a really good stationary brand i love their stuff um but yeah basically they're just simple highlighters one end is like the flat tip to highlight and then one is like a uh, pointed tip so if you want to like circle stuff or draw something i love these and they're such pretty pastel colors they're great quality but yeah simple but awesome i love these Next up are some gel pens slash pens. I'll show you the gel pen set first. These are just a set of three. Comes with bronze, gold, and white. I love these for, again, working with black paper. So if you're working on like really dark paper that's like very dark colored or just black, like I said, it writes so beautifully and so pigmented and you can see the pen on the black paper, which is so cool and so fun. So if you're someone who likes doing crafts with paper or j journaling or stuff like that these are so fun i also really like using this white one for if i'm doing like precise highlighting or detailing in like some kind of pencil or pencil crayon drawing or paintings like it's so nice to just get that tiny little like dot of white if you really need to but i like using these for all sorts of things really great last but not least pens i love pens i can never have too many pens i just I have an addiction okay but these are they're not all the same well these are the zebra as well Sar sarasa sarasa <laughs> pens they're all pastel colors which i really love pastels so these ones really stand out to me and they work really great they're nice and fine tips so if you need to get like nice fine detailings in a drawing or if you're simply just writing in a journal they work great and i very much love these and they're an affordable price all right, that about wraps up my video for today. I know I had a lot of items in here, some very random items, but these are some of the things that I use a lot and I love and I found great prices on Amazon compared to other stores where I had seen them or maybe I didn't even find them anywhere. But yeah, I really hope you liked this and I will have all the stuff linked down below. Ones that are discontinued, I did try to find my or I did try my best to find very similar ones, or if not the exact same, just by a different person. All right, that about wraps up my video for today. I really hope that you enjoyed, and if you did, please feel free to like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell to see upcoming videos. And yeah, I really hope you have a great rest of your day, and take care.